Hey guys, in a previous video I showed you how to build this smart mirror uh, and you may recall that it has a built-in Amazon voice assistant uh, and it's running the magic mirror software on top of a Raspberry Pi. This is called a smart mirror but it's really just a voice assistant and a static application. It was a shame that you couldn't get the voice assistant to interact with the Raspberry Pi hosting the magic mirror. Um, so I've set up a custom skill that lets you talk to the Amazon Voice Assistant uh, and run scripts on this Raspberry Pi. So let me give you an example where I will turn this off and then back on again and explain what's going on. Alexa, ask Magic Mirror off. Turning off. Okay, so it's turning off this Magic Mirror, which means my voice uh, command, the voice invocation, registered a very specific action. Uh, so when I say off, it posts a message on an Amazon queue with the word off. Then the Raspberry Pi has a script set up that's constantly reading from that queue. And when it reads the message off, it runs the TV off script. Now let's turn it back on. Alexa, ask Magic Mirror on. Turning on. So to turn on, what's happened there is my Alexa skill... I said your name, I'm sorry. Sorry, I didn't understand the question I heard. So what's going on here is my Amazon voice assistant skill writes a message called on or off to a queue hosted in the cloud. The Raspberry Pi has a script which is constantly reading from this cloud hosted queue and performing specific actions based on the message received. So on and off were the first ones I implemented which just turn on and off the monitor here uh, I've also added some magic mirror configuration so you can flip between different displays here. Let's jump to a simple display. Alexa, ask magic mirror simple. Loading minimal display. So this is going to exit the magic mirror application. A package manager will relaunch that, but first I copy a configuration script with a simpler display. So we've exited, we're back to the dashboard, it's copying the configuration script now. Uh, momentarily, the Magic Mirror software will run once more, but with a different setup. There's a short five second delay because I'm trying to keep the total number of requests for the queue service below one million a month. So I only check every five seconds. As maybe you've put together by now, I'm using keywords, to run a script. So it doesn't have to be Magic Mirror, it doesn't have to be on your Raspberry Pi, anything with an internet connection can check the queue. Um, so the ramifications for home automation are really massive. Anything you can put into a script, you can trigger with a custom phrase. I'm not going to go into the coding details in this video. Uh, they're not very challenging, it's more of just an exercise of getting the Amazon Lambda function, the voice assistant skill, the simple queue service, and your script running on the Raspberry Pi all to talk to the same resources. Um, I walk you through it all in the links. If you're not planning to build it, but you have some ideas about what you would like the voice assistant to trigger on your computer, uh, please post some comments because I know there are a lot of things that can be done. Anything that can be put in a script can be done. Um, but so far, my creative juices haven't come up with more than what you can see here. Thanks very much.